Hi you guys, tonight I am doing a full night of self-care. Let's jump right into it. <laughs> First, I'm gonna start by taking all of my vitamins. I will share all the benefits of all the vitamins that I take, and I will link them all down below in the description. First, I'm taking vitamin D3. It's for bone health, immune support, and healthy muscular function. I take one of these every day. I love taking vitamin D, especially during winter and like during seasonal depression and just when it's cold out, I love vitamin D. Next, I am taking turmeric. There is so many benefits of turmeric. Um, top uses on the book, it says cellular and immune health, joint pain, swelling, high blood sugar, cholesterol, poor metabolism, blood, liver, toxicity, parasites, acne, bloating, skin health, and so much more. If you're not taking turmeric, I definitely recommend it. Next, I am taking the doTERRA VEO Mega Essential Oil Omega Complex Dietary Supplement. I take one of these. This helps with brain fog, immunity support, your skin. Next, I am taking the doTERRA XEO Mega Essential Oil Omega Complex. I have really bad ADHD where if I don't take this, I notice a huge difference where I like can't stop moving. So this helps me focus. Especially when I have long work days, I take two of these. This also helps with anxiety, depression, postpartum. This stuff is amazing. Can't live without her. <laughs> Last vitamin that I take is the doTERRA MetaPower. This stuff helps with your metabolism, helps with your hunger and all that. I have a really slow metabolism, so good. I take two of these and that is it for my vitamins. But next, now I take chlorophyll and I have been taking this for a few years. My skin has cleared up my skin texture. Everything has really cleared up once I started taking chlorophyll. I barely do any water just because I really like to chug it. And I also notice after taking chlorophyll that my hair is more shiny and way more healthier. So cheers. Internally, I'm good. Now let's move to the outside. The best part. We are here in my bathroom. I am gonna start by exfoliating and shaving. I'm so obsessed with this exfoliator from Josie Moran. It's the Argon Sugar Bomb Body Scrub, and I ordered this off of Amazon just to help scoop it, just because I hate the sugar scrub under my nails. Next, I take the Shea Moisture Coconut Oil and I use this as my shaving cream. Not only does it like fully hydrate your skin, it just makes you feel like so, so smooth. Now that I shaved literally my whole body, I am gonna self-tan. 
Before I self tan, I'm going to be using my favorite serums by Truly Beauty. Also, shout out Truly for the softest and cutest robe ever, and this is not sponsored, I swear. First, I'm using the Barbie Bikini Serum. Then I am using the Nice Melons Boob Serum. The Berry Cheeky Butt Serum. And lastly, the Mighty Tidy Body Sculpting Tightening Serum. It's pretty self-explanatory, all these serums, but I can't show them on here, obviously. But I will come back after I finish putting all the serum on. <laughs> I just finished putting all the serums on. The body tightening one, I just put on like my arms, my legs, my neck, my stomach. While I let that dry, I'm going to wipe my teeth and put on these under eye masks. Now I'm gonna whiten my teeth with the Moon Teeth Whitening Kit. These strips are dissolvable, so that's really cool. <laughs> the timer just went off on my teeth whitening kit, so now I am gonna self tan my body and my face. These were like stuck on my face. <laughs> For tanner, I am using the Coco and Eve Sunny Honey. I love this stuff so much. It looks so natural and it doesn't leave any streaks and it's not too orange. This is the packaging and what it looks like. And then I use the Coco and Eve Tanning Mitt. I just finished self tanning. I wish I could have showed you more, but it was way too hard without like flashing you guys. So now I'm going to self tan my face. I use the Coco and Eve face spray. I usually just shake it up and then I spray it on my face, fan it, spray it on my face, fan it. I usually rub it in because I don't trust just spraying it. I usually rub it so it gets everywhere on my face. And then obviously I wash my hands after, but I do that anyway, just because I don't want any streaks on my hands from my tanner. I definitely make sure I rub on the bridge of my nose because last time I didn't and you could tell there was like dark right here and it wouldn't go away. I usually fan it until it's fully dry and then I spray it again. I love being a girl. <laughs> I just dermaplaned my face yesterday or I would have dermaplaned my face before I self tanned it. I am gonna end this video here. It's been two and a half, three hours and I'm tired. I just wanna lay down. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I am gonna be filming another self care video when I get my lashes and my nails and my toes done. So stay tuned for that, but love you guys so much. Bye.